There are so many things in space that seem to be without rhyme or reason. Scientists continue to come across new discoveries that seem random, bizarre or even haunting. However, it's sometimes more fascinating when we find something that does have order, almost as if it's preordained or designed, and one of NASA's recent discoveries is just that. NASA and other scientists have released images of not one, but two strange shapes found on planets in our solar systems. The mysterious pair of hexagons has stunned scientists across the globe and left them asking two major questions. What are they and how did they form? In this video, you'll find out exactly what this hexagon-shaped phenomenon really is, where they came from and what it reveals about these two terrifying planets. We are all very familiar with how storm systems look here on Earth. Any time a news channel has reported on a hurricane or a typhoon, you've got a good view of how they form and move. It's spiraling, circular and usually looks chaotic. In other words, it's never a perfect shape with uniform edges, like a hexagon. But that's what the storm system on Saturn appears like, a perfectly sculpted hexagon shape. It's a truly stunning occurrence that is so foreign and alien to us Earthlings and hasn't been found on any other planet or moon. The hexagon is massive, to put it mildly. Most estimates say it's about 20,000 miles in diameter and is filled with fierce winds that blow up to 300 miles per hour. A storm like this is sure to catch the eye of scientists and raise a few questions. That's exactly what it's been doing since its discovery back in 1981 when the Voyager 1 caught a glimpse of it. It was then spotted again by the Cassini craft. Unfortunately, Voyager 1 and Cassini weren't able to dive deep enough to find out more about the storm, so instead, it just delivered its finding and so many questions back to the scientists at NASA. The genesis of the stormy Saturn hexagon has been the subject of two persistent ideas since its uncovering. And now, two scientists who have studied it think they might have figured out the storm's origins. Jeremy Bloxham, a professor of geophysics and research associate Rakesh K. Yadav from Harvard's Department of Earth and Planetary Sciences, have possibly unlocked the secrets of the hexagon. These two propose that the massive, oddly shaped hurricane is created when atmospheric flows deep within Saturn, making large and small cyclones that surround a larger horizontal jet stream blowing east near the planet's North Pole which also happens to have a large number of storms within. Bloxham and Yadav claim that the smaller storms interact with the larger ones and push the eastern jet stream to the top of the planet, which warps the stream into a hexagon. Yadav broke it down in layman's terms. Imagine you have a rubber band and place a bunch of smaller rubber bands around it again and again. Then you firmly squeeze the entire thing from the outside, that rubber band ring at the centre of it all is going to be compressed and then form a weird shape with a certain number of strict edges. That's possibly what's going on with the hexagon storm system. There are these smaller storms and they're pinching the larger storms at the polar region of the planet. Since they have to coexist, they need to find a space to basically house each storm system. The result is a bizarre polygonal shape. According to the researchers, their computer model did not generate a flawless hexagon. Instead, they spotted a nine-sided polygon moving at the speed of Saturn's storm. Nonetheless, the shape serves as proof of concept for the larger theory on how the massive storm arose and why it has remained basically unaltered for over 40 years, according to the researchers. More atmospheric data from Saturn is needed, according to Yadav and Bloxham, to fine-tune their model and get a better understanding of what's going on with the storm over time. But even though the science behind the test leaves a lot unanswered, it gives the best information and basis for what the storm is and why it is formed. One hexagon storm on a planet far from Earth is weird enough, but what about two? Well, in 2019, NASA discovered that Saturn's unique hexagon wasn't so unique after all. The Juno space probe caught sight of something bizarre on Jupiter, similar to the phenomenon found on Saturn. A series of swirling storms arranged in a geometric pattern. Down at the south pole of the planet, 
a swathe of storms was raging and speeding through the planet's atmosphere. Six storms total, a central cyclone with five others surrounding it. However, these five smaller storms were orbiting the center one in the shape of a perfect pentagon. The distance between the storms was so measured, it almost looked as if the formation was intentional. It was shocking, to say the least. This was discovered back in 2016, but something wild happened when the probe looked again just recently. A new storm had formed along with the others, which now created a seamless hexagon shape instead of a pentagon. Researchers said the new storm was smaller than the others, only the size of Texas. Yes, that's what's considered a small storm on Jupiter. In many ways, it seems that these storms are similar to what we find with Earth's hurricanes. If you were to go below the surface of the oddly shaped storms, you would find wind, hail, snow and other things that aren't uncommon on our planet. But of course there are major differences too, namely their ability to hang around for a very long time is different from what we see here. As you know, Earth's hurricanes run out of warm water when they hit continents, which causes them to slowly fall apart. But there is no land on Jupiter, so the storms can keep going and going. This means that the storms spotted on Jupiter are able to make it all the way down to the poles of the planet, another attribute that you won't find on Earth. So what is causing these strange shapes? No one is entirely sure, but they have an idea. Through a series of tests and simulations, scientists have proposed that the geometric shapes form when each storm is surrounded by a ring of winds that turn in the opposite direction from the spinning storms, creating what's called an anticyclonic ring. The presence of these rings causes the storms to repel each other rather than merge together. That's a reasonable explanation for what is causing the storms and their peculiar shapes, but some people may wonder, why does it matter? What is the point of finding out how a storm on Saturn or Jupiter works? Well, it can help us get a better handle of the storms we have here on Earth, actually. Other planets have much wilder conditions and behaviours than Earth. Therefore, scientists often look to the weather patterns of other planets to essentially stress test theories about the weather here to see if they hold up under harsher conditions. But understanding these bizarre storms on distant planets also gives us a better understanding of how they work and what sort of conditions and elements exist there. These hexagon-shaped storms on Saturn and Jupiter aren't just some cool things to look at, they are keys to figuring out how those planets operate and what makes the universe so special and varied. Thanks for watching another episode of Voyager. While you are still here, go ahead and click the video on your screen for more mind-blowing videos about space.